We did it. We did a rebrand already, you know, baby. But uh, but but why? Why why did I rebrand? Well, let's answer some of your questions. Now I don't have any of them written down. I'm just gonna go off my big fat noggin head over here because uh, that's just good enough for me, even though I can barely speak English. But uh, hey ho, we're on with it. But anyways, if you did watch the video a couple days ago that I posted of when or if I could quit GT Online, this may give you some clarity to why I was maybe hinting at, oh, maybe it might not be my main game in the future, even though my current name at the time was Why Not GTA, but it might not be. This is what I was hinting to. The fact that I was going to rebrand and that it wouldn't, like, trap me from just making GTA content. Now, for those of you who might be a little bit confused, trapped? What the hell do you mean by trapped? Well, I was trapped in a box because of my name. No, the, the name didn't weigh a shitload and it trapped me in a cardboard box, all right? You little funny little fuckers. I see you out there, okay? You little funny fuckers. But no, it was trapped me in a box hypothetically by the means of when I would play something else, people would always make the joke of, eh, your name's not a GTA, you're playing this game, but this isn't GTA. You're not funny, all right? The joke wasn't funny. If the joke was funny, I wouldn't have found it annoying, but it wasn't funny. So it just got annoying after a little while and the only time you're gonna be first and making a joke is when you're talking about yourself Okay, that's the only time you're first about making a joke. Okay yourself move on But uh, anyways, yeah I changed my name because I was trapped in that box of just playing GT online I didn't want to get trapped in that now for one again If you didn't watch that video, you probably should watch it being when I might quit GTA online or whatever You should probably watch it because do not worry as it stands right now I am not just going to drop GTA and just move on to a bunch of indie games and whatever. I might do some indie games, but I've still got a bunch of ideas that I want to do in GTA Online. Some creative, some completely brand new, and others that I'm just going to add my own a little twist to it. But also, the name and the logo. The Why Not GTA name and the Why Not GTA logo were both horseshit. The only reason I changed my name to Why Not GTA was for two factors. One, my original name when I first started posting on YouTube was just why not, as I was a mo I'm, a, I'm an uncreative piece of shit, all right? I, I can't think of names. I'm terrible at thinking of names. Ideas, I'm pretty good at that. But names, I'm absolute horseshit at. But also the logo, I made that in five minutes on my phone on a free app. I just typed why not, and I just put the GTA logo underneath it. It's so low quality. I don't know how I managed to get 16 and a half thousand subs with that as my logo. I, I don't understand. So yeah, I didn't like the logo. I didn't like the name. But then I thought of Rufa. Now, just quickly, how did I think of the name Rufa? I ain't got a fucking clue. Like most ideas that I come up with, it comes right before I'm about to sleep. No, don't be dirty minded. That's what, only what I do on Thursday nights. However, <laughs> that's fucking dirty. But anyways, I thought of it just before I was about to go to sleep. Because I was thinking of names. It was about the time when I was trying to think of a name. Did I, do I know how I thought of the name? Fuck no. I have no clue. It just popped in my head. I didn't even know the name existed. Which, by the way, if your name is actually like Rufa in like any way. Hi. I like your name. <laughs> I took it. I hope you don't mind. But yeah. I thought of the name somehow. I think I was talking like... Woof, woof, woof. I was like, woof, woof, roof, fur, dogs have fur, they woof, roof, fur. Oh my god, I'm like a fucking caveman bashing rocks together, like, huh, this works. Ah, my fucking knuckles. But yeah, do I really know how I thought of the name? Absolutely no. Do I like it? Yes. Did I like it after a week? Yes. Did any other names point out after a week? No. So I ran with Rufa. And then that here we are today. And the logo. Do you think I made that? Hell no. I just got the blueprints together. I did some shit sketches of how I wanted it to look. Gave it to an artist, or actually multiple artists. And I was like, make a logo out of it. And uh, this was the one I liked. Obviously, it might change a little bit. If like some people point out like, this could be better or this could be better. I might change it a little bit. But other than that, this is the final logo. And on that, this is it. I wanted something that I could like in a year, two years, five years. I wanted a name and a logo that I would like in that time. And this is it. Might be a couple changes here and there along the way, but this is it. In a, two years, I 100% would have not liked the Why Not GTA logo and also the Why Not GTA name. I wanted to change it right now. And I also wanted to have some sort of event because I like stuff being cool. So uh, 
yeah, that's why I made the video yesterday, looking how it looked, and also did the months long of teasing with the intro teasers, but also the fact of I learned a lot throughout this. If I did something like this in the future, I wouldn't put an intro teaser at the front of every single video. I might do something else where it could be like during the video or something like that. And also, I probably wouldn't make it go on for this long. At the end of the day, it was just the name, but I wanted it to at least be cool and also learn quite a bit from it. But I guess now, there you pretty much have it. Why did I change my name to Rufa? Why did I rebrand? Get myself out of that box. Make it so I can do literally whatever I want and have the name and logo be the thing that I liked or still like in five years, 10 years, when I fucking retire and this channel is just sat here with a bunch of videos on it and you're watching it still for some reason. Hello 2025 or something like that. I don't know. I hope I'm still relevant then. I hope I have like, let's say 100,000 subs by 2025. That'd be good. That'd be quite nice if I if that happened. But anyways, if you did enjoy this video, then a big thank you. And hopefully you stick around until 2025 and see what happens. But with that said, hopefully you can go check out this video up here recommended to you by YouTube. Or check out this video down here, which is my latest upload. But anyways, with that said, hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day. And I'll see you guys in the next one.